During Tywin's funeral, Loras attempts to approach Cersei, speaking of how supposedly fearsome Tywin was, but Cersei ignores him and stalks off. One night, Loras is in bed with Olivar, discussing the possibility of visiting Dornay or anywhere far away from King's Landing, when Marjorie walks in. She admonishes Loras for making them late for supper with King Tommen. After Olivar has taken his leave, Marjorie urges her brother to be more discreet, especially in the Red Keep. Loras no longer cares as he knows everybody is whispering about him anyway. Loras is puzzled by Marjorie's relaxed attitude, as Tywin's death means Cersei won't be forced to marry Loras and be sent off with him to Highgarden, which means Marjorie will have to contend with her mother in law at the capital. Marjorie implies that may not be the case. Loras is present during the wedding ceremony of Tom and Baratheon and his sister Marjorie. During a sparring session, Loras is seized by Lancel Lannister and the Faith Militant. Lancel tells Loras that he has broken the laws of gods and men. Marjorie deduces that Loras's arrest was partly Cersei's doing in order to undermine the new queen. Tommen later attempts to have Loras released by confronting his mother, then trying to speak to the High Sparrow, but neither endeavor bears any fruit prompting Marjorie to write at once to Olena. During his holy inquest by the faith, a somewhat disheveled Loras is interrogated by the High Sparrow about his relationship with Renly. Loras denies he was Renly's lover, telling the High Sparrow they were merely best friends, but cannot look him in the eye. He also denies having lain with any other man. Marjorie, when asked to testify, backs her brother up. The High Sparrow then calls forth a surprise witness, to Loras's horror. Olivar, who, on Cersei's instructions, informs the court that he and Loras were sexually involved, although he slightly misrepresents the situation by making it seem like Loras pursued him first, when Olivar was actually the one who was asked by Littlefinger to seek out Loras and seduce him as a way to get information on the Tyrells. Loras is furious and attempts to attack Olivar but is restrained. This leads to Marjorie's arrest for perjury and a full trial before the gods for Loras.